Hey guys, Ben Tate here, and it's been a while since I've had a tutorial out, so I thought I'd put together a new one. And this one's going to cover EV mapping in uh, 3D Studio Max with the Unwrap modifier. I am going to be using the newest version, 2012, uh, although if you have an older version, you should still be able to follow along uh, without any problems. Uh, the Unwrap window has been changed quite a bit, so it will look a lot different than the older versions of Max. Uh, but aside from a few newer tools, you should still have all the functionality you need to follow along. Okay, and this will be aimed uh, more at the beginner crowd, so um, in the first part we're just going to lay down some UVs that's found in Max, and in the second part uh, we're actually going to do the UVs on an entire small little scene that I built, Okay, which I'll provide so you can follow along. Uh, but in the first part we're just going to lay down some uh, UVs on some simple objects, look at some of the mapping techniques, and I'm not going to cover every single uh, tool found in the Unwrap window, we're just going to use what we need. Um, so let's get into it. and. UV mapping definitely isn't one of the funner things to do in 3D. It's pretty tedious and boring. So I put together a little overdone musical interlude for you to hopefully get you a little bit more excited about following this tutorial. 